Okay, we bought this uh, rug doctor about 2010 or 2011, and then it sat for like 10, 12 years after we'd used it, and it would not work. So I went online, tried to figure something out, looked it all over, and there that silver thing there is a pump. That's your that's your pump for your for your liquid. And they can stick after a while, especially if you don't clean them out and run fresh water through them when you're done, which I did not do. So anyway, what they said, you, you just got to kind of tap on it. And what I used was a, a long screwdriver and put it on, just laid it on top of it and then wrapped it, I don't know, four or five times. And that, uh, there you can see the motor jump. It uh, That shows you the motor was on. And wrap it there four or five times <clears throat> and break that diaphragm whatever stuck in there and then to test it what I did was I put some Dawn dish soap and water with the blue color and mixed it up and that hose there is your feed hose for the pump so if you put that on that feed hose <clears throat> watch watch below now and if it's working you'll see that okay there the soapy water is coming out so the pump did break loose which I was thankful for because I think it'd be a, a bear cat to put in a new one on this on this thing. It was bad enough doing this. This took me several hours to do. It was a it was quite a quite a complicated thing getting it apart and uh, especially going back together because <clears throat> it is this thing is precision made and it goes together one way and so you got to uh, put your screws in some jars and mark them and take some video when you're doing it because uh, it is easy to get mixed up on that thing. And your biggest thing is take your time because this has a very high frustration level when you're going back. Stuff don't want to fit <clears throat> or you think it don't want to fit mainly because you haven't done it before and you don't know how to put it together. But anyway, it is. Uh, we got it working. So there you uh you need a, you'll need a long screwdriver to get some of the screws back in a magnetic really helps. I had that one right there was very handy. If it's got a good mag magnetic head, you're way ahead of the game. And this right here that square hole is there's a there's like a filter thing. And that's that's your air suck thing right there. And just from this little right here, you can just see that this thing it goes one way in that but uh, this this thing goes one way and that's it and you can't you can't force it you can't it, you just got to hit the right uh, the right I guess you we used to say you not gritting your teeth the right way or something but uh, once you get it right it will go and it will all go back together and uh, knowing that because somebody did put it together and if they put it together at one time you can take it apart you can put it together you just got to take your time with this thing there are the bottoms on it, and here's the, here's the top going back with the top. And this is the wrong way to do it. I learned the hard way. And you'll see it just, it just does not want to fit on there at all. And so what you do, you take that top, see that top piece, I finally got smart and took it off. And then it will uh, slap into place. You still got to wiggle it a little bit, but it will go. And you want to be sure that you got that hose on that hole. Uh, there's a, a spout that goes in that goes in that hose. You just want to make sure it's on there and that you that you don't pull it off going on. Once it's on, it, it's on. It'll, it'll stay good. You got no problem there. But just make sure it is hooked up. It's on the uh, down at the bottom at the left side, and it's what we put the 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 jar of blue dish soap in that was the feed hose for the pump and just make sure that your spout is kind of a spout there make sure it's inside there but you can see once this is taken apart this goes together a whole lot better but I spent a long time putting this thing back together it was uh, it got very tiresome towards the end but it will work a nice set of screwdrivers is is handy if you got something that's actually will kind of new and doesn't slip and everything it uh, makes it a lot better working on it but here we're going to test it out and see what see if it'll work or not
So here, and uh, with this one here, it only, no, I don't know about the rest of them, this one here only uh, uh, sucks and works when you pull it towards you. <clears throat> I think, I don't know what we gave for it. It seemed like about $400 back in 2010. Fairly expensive, actually. It works like a charm. So here we're dumping, and uh, you can see the color of the water. It does get the dirt out. But I've been doing construction on this place and rehab, and it, it was it was filthy and I don't know how many times I went over it but it, it, it kept pulling up dirt and finally it started turning tan and then a little bit clear but anyway that is the that is the rug doctor thing for the pump smack it with something and hope for the best and uh, when you test it the uh, soapy water works well anyway uh, you all be safe thanks for watching and have a good day